y'all. Happy Friday. Okay, Hi, so. Today, my name is Asta, and I am with the Frozen Fractal, and I got Frozen Fractal's hair. Okay, guys, so Harper is um, Elsa today, and she, have frozen, she has Frozen Fractals. So, we dropped the video today, um, and I want to say thank you so much for all the love on the video. The video was... Um, what is it? I think it's, I'm addressing this for the last time. I want to tell you guys thank you so much for all the love on that video. That was awesome. You guys are in my DMs and you guys have been commenting on the actual video and I appreciate it. Um, I'm walking around in our media room. This, um, I have to tell you guys a secret actually. <laughs> okay, so this ladder's here because I've been working on it ceiling and I've been working on this um I have like these ideas that I love to do and I get like so passionate about it and then like if it doesn't work out like right away then it just kind of like dies and never gets done but I'm, I'm going to finish that because I think that it's gonna look amazing when it's done anyway the girls are home today here's Miss Holland she's ready to eat so I'm about to uh, make her a bottle here is Elsa my teacher using the class. Okay, she's teacher in the class. She likes for us to be students. Here is Babe. So that's what we have going on. Today's Friday. I said that. So I said that. I, I said that. Um what are our plans today? So this weekend, Harper has dance because now she has dance yeah. every Saturday. Holland has a doctor's appointment on Sunday. Um, we have to create some content, so we have to go out to Perimeter Mall to do that. Yeah. Okay, so I think today after work, we should go get some I-C-E-C-R-E-A-M. Okay. But I got to wait for my boss to see if my boss says that we can do it. Let me wait. You. That ain't your business to tell. <laughs> hey y'all, so I am on my first break. Um, typically, I need to get my cup cup. Typically on my first break, if I haven't had my second cup of coffee, I go make myself another cup of coffee. Um, what already happened this morning? Um, if you follow me on Instagram, at Miller J, I shared <laughs> me trying some avocado toast for the first time. It was actually pretty good, but I'm ready for a snack now. So, <laughs> Um, we had a little Domino's last night. Um, what was I about to say? So yeah, so we had Instacart come to the house. So we got our groceries. So we should be good. At lunch, I'm going to make, um, I think I want some tomato soup actually. Um, anyone else like, I just, um, love tomato soup, but Harper gave me a little, <clears throat> like just a little bit and, uh, I hate having a sore throat and soup just feels so good when I have a sore throat. So yeah, so I'm gonna make some of that and probably make me some more coffee um, because I didn't have whipped cream this morning, but look at, do you guys see this pantry? Um, but now I got whipped cream, so I gotta make myself some new coffee. That's just how that works. So yeah, so I need to go get my cup so I could do a re-up. I wonder what, she was doing with the batteries our batteries are down here so i was just wondering um what sequina was doing with the batteries um you guys i can't wait to show you guys what we've done in our uh formal dining room i'm looking at it right now but it's just um we haven't been able to get the color right for the cabinets that we have built in. So that's just all we've been waiting on to show you. And it's not something that's even noticeable on camera yet, but you know, we really, we, we just want it right before we share. And then um, you guys, I think some of you guys may know, one of my friends is an interior designer. So she did come through and uh, put some spots, put, um, Made, made the home feel more homier. So some spaces that I was having trouble like brainstorming on how to get creative with, which you guys have like seen bits in our videos. That's what she was able to do. So that's what I have going on. Um, so Queen is still working. Harp's eating her first snack of the day. She's eating a little popcorn and the baby boo fell asleep. So that's all we got. You got something to say? You got something to say? Oh, okay. 
Happy Friday, guys. I just wanted to jump in and say good morning. Um, I'm actually about to jump in my meeting real quick, and I'm actually um, doing the icebreaker today for my meeting. Um, of course, it's via WebEx. But um, So I wanted to share the icebreaker with you guys. The icebreaker I chose was what um, what's your first job? So for me, my first job was Chuck E. Cheese. I remember my first day, I was like actually stuffing the napkin holders and like refilling the crushed red peppers and garlic and i just remember thinking like oh my god like this is not going to be the job for me so um jamila always jokes and says that i was chucky the mouse the rat whatever but no it was never that i think i got i did like the waitress type of thing like dropping off pizza, refilling stuff, and then sometime I would do the prizes. But I think I only lasted about a month there. Then um, when I turned 16, um, I started working at this telemarketing company called West in Hampton. Um, if any of you guys follow me from back home, you know about West. Like that was just like the call center to work at. It was like one of those typical call center lives. Um, we were doing telemarketing calls, so like if you would see things on TV, or even when Miss Cleo was big, you could call the psychic line. Like it, you would be calling in to Wes, or like I think one of them was like the shark vacuum cleaner or something else. I, I really can't think of it right now, but it was like so many things that you could see. Like call right now and buy one get one free, or for free shipping, and we would just legit take your order for stuff like that. But yeah, so let's meet in the comments and let me know your first job. Um, I want to say Jamil's is Costco, but we'll see if I'm right because I'm going to have her pick up the camera when she goes back upstairs and tell you guys her very first job. But um, yeah, so let me know if you also are still in that field where you first started. Let me know because I, mean, I know it's either like when you first start working, either your first job guides you to what you totally don't want to do. Like you're like, I never want to do this again. So, you know, for me, when I worked at Chuck E. Cheese, I knew waitressing and like restaurant work was not for me and I hadn't been back since. Um, but I know some people who start off where, you know, in waitressing or something and that is actually the career path. But whatever, you know, sometimes your first job gears you up to what you want to do for the rest of your life that you're passionate about. I'm about to hop in my meeting, but like I said, we're going to see if I'm right. I feel like Jamila's, wait, Costco. Do I want to go with Costco? No, I'm going to go with Subway. I feel like her first job was Subway. We'll see if I'm right though. But let's go in the comments. You tried to guess my first job? Mm -hmm. You don't remember? I said, I thought I could have Costco, but I was like, no, nah, I think it's Subway. So um, I wasn't around when she asked y'all the, what do you call it? The icebreaker. Mm -hmm. So I guess that her first job was wearing a costume mm -hmm. at Chuck E. Cheese. You know how they had the mouse? And what else at Chuck E. Cheese? They had a couple of characters. So I think that she was wearing a costume and performing for the kids. Mm -hmm. Um, my first job was a sandwich artist. I knew it. At Subway. Oh, um, oh. Um. I worked there. I worked at Subway for six months and I actually got a raise while I was there. I got like a 60 cent mm -hmm. raise when I was there. So yeah, that was my first job. And then I went to the mall. I worked at Buckle and then I worked at American Eagle and then I stopped and then I worked as a sample girl in Costco <laughs> and then um, I got a job at CarMax Auto Finance and I worked there. Y'all know y'all been asking me about the CarMax story that I don't think enough years have gone by to tell that story. And then I went to the Are job. Are you drinking my coffee? No, that's my coffee. No, okay. But you don't have nothing that's just yours in this house. You share. <laughs> We're teaching our children how to share. <laughs> Go juicy, go juicy, go juicy, go, go, go juicy, go juicy, go, 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 go. You want more? Is your mother crazy? Go juicy, go juicy, go juicy, go You better shake that thing, girl. Shake it fast. Hey, y'all, so I'm on lunch now. Um, well, I'm turning Harper's phone off because she never turns it off. Like, it's just always somewhere in the background. YouTube Kids is in the background. So, um, we're on lunch. We're actually about to, I can't remember if I told you guys that we have a management company now. We are managed by my dream management company now. So, yeah. Uh, um, Super excited about that. So we actually have a meeting with um, our manager and 
two minutes. Uh, so just getting the girls ready. Um, Harper's taking a nap. Um, this one, she needs a nose clean. I gotta clean that real quick. And um, yeah, so typically in a work day, we have meetings for Jamila and Q. When we have those meetings, I schedule them after work and on lunch. So we're just kind of always like bouncing around. So yeah, so let, we'll let you guys know how that goes. Okay, so now we um, do have some content that we need to set live today. So when we have partnerships, um, typically a brand will come to us. In the past, what's happened a lot is that the brand comes to us and say, hey, we have this um, collab, we wanna do a partnership, we have a campaign coming up, are you guys interested? Uh, so Queen and I review it to see if it aligns like with us and what we believe in. And if it does, we talk rates, terms and conditions, and then we purchase, purchase, and then we um, create the content. So we have one that's going live today. So what that entails is we've already done the content. We've already sent it to the brand. The brand has given us feedback. We made a couple tweaks to it, resent it to them. They approved, and now it's all set to go live. The most annoying thing about that, because people just think like, oh, you just take a picture and post it, like, no. Um, you really have to pay attention to all the asks from the brand. Um, we self shoot as of right now, so that's a lot in and of itself. And then, you know, you have the whole back end of creating a story and um, creating the stories and or creating an in feed post. So that could be a lot. It could be very time consuming because essentially you're creating stories on Instagram or whatever platform and you're not setting them live yet so then it's like you almost have to redo the whole thing when it's time so I'm gonna do that now and make sure when you guys see it you guys show some love you got anything to say you you want to say baby mm -mm, I'm good all right so I'm gonna take care of that then I'll focus on some lunch and then get back to work. Hopefully we'll get off early and then we're going to a food truck park. It's not a park. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Hey, all. okay, so um, what I'm gonna do is actually cook us some lunch. Harper's laid down for her nap. Um, I think, I wanna say Sequina's still working. So I'm actually gonna air fry some wingettes and I got some jerk sauce that I wanna do a little jerk on so we'll see how that turns out okay y'all so i got my chicken that i just cleaned um i cleaned the chicken and then i also dried it to get it make sure it stays crispy um i'm gonna do a little onion i don't measure like i let my my ancestors tell me how much seasoning um a little garlic powder probably a lot of garlic powder um we've been really into slap your mama um, I don't like light skin chicken, so I use paprika. Like I'm all out of everything. Okay, so I love smoked paprika on chicken and on um, salmon. And Sequina will be like, I don't like smoked paprika, but she eat it all the time and don't even know it. That's why sometimes you can't be telling them um, what you putting in it, cause they're gonna eat it regardless. But then now, she watch she's gonna watch this video and see that i'm doing it and she's gonna be like yeah I, re I actually didn't really like it okay so i like a lot of paprika so that's what i put in and then okay so i have this jerk sauce seasoning um i feel like i've seen a couple people i know have this in their fridge like my island friends so i felt comfortable getting this i'm gonna use one of harper's <laughs> Spoons, and then I'm just gonna put it in there. I just don't like when jerk is too sweet. Like, do you ever go to a restaurant and it's almost like they put like cinnamon in it? Ugh. it drives me crazy. Okay. So then I get my tongs and this is how we're looking. I feel like no one likes to look at raw chicken, so I really don't like kind of show. It, I mean, it kind of grosses me out, honestly. But I'm just kind of um, tossing it. Okay, you see? <clears throat> All right, so 
I'm gonna get some foil and put it in the air fryer. Okay, y'all, sorry, the memory card was full. Okay, so this is um, the situation so far. So I, I am going to put it in the air fryer um, and put it on the chicken setting. That's usually 20 minutes. And then I look at it, I flip everyone and run 20 minutes again. So it's like twice air fried and it comes out super crispy. Um, yeah. Okay. Oh, good job, baby. All right, y'all, so chicken is good, nice and crispy. I'm not getting like so much of a jerk taste, but like a little spice. So maybe that is jerk and spice, maybe. Hmm. That's good though, but the, the Cajun pasta, that's it. That's that's, that's what you that's like? That. I ate hot What you eat? Grilled cheese. Grilled cheese. Grilled cheese. And then Holland is upset because I left her and she's ready to finish her avocado, which um, she really enjoyed. Okay, y'all. Let me uh, try this chicken. That's pretty good. I'm looking at the queen because she was acting like it wasn't real good. So, I actually ended up cooking it on three cycles of the chicken. The third cycle on the chicken setting on my air fryer. The third cycle, I flipped it twice. But cause I, because I just like it to be real crispy. So. Y'all see that steam? Yeah. That's really good. Good morning, cousins. It is Sunday. We are just getting up. Getting ready to make the girls some waffles. I like get waffles. Jay Mills is over there. She's shocked because this turned into a two person deal. I wanted her to make the batter and then I'm going to make the heart shaped waffles. Set it up. 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 I'm going to get the hmm? get... Okay, so we're laying in bed. I just gave Harper some medicine because she needed just a little cough medicine. And. <laughs> and I call him my elbow. That's right. So, Sequina goes, surprising. I was shocked when she said it. She goes, hey guys, you want me to make you waffles? So then Harper goes, yeah. And then Holland, you know, everyone says she'd be looking like she want to eat. And I no, really don't no know what that shots. means. No shots, cousin. And, um, they be saying she'd be ready to eat. Like, she'd just be looking like she want to eat something. I'm to and I still don't know what that means. So then I used the bathroom, so I was gone for an undisclosed amount of time. So I come back and she's like, Can you just make the batter? <laughs> Yo, that's like like 50% of the of the cooking. No, no, no. Oh wow! This is the hard part right here. Alright, Harp, how is it? It's good? You thinking about it, Julesy? You thinking about it? She was watching Harper eat like, uh-uh, it's my turn. Hey y'all, so it is actually Sunday. We are getting ready to... Yes, baby? No, I think your mommy is in her room. Oh yeah. Okay, so we are actually getting ready to go to Perimeter. Um, I have a, I have some content that I need to shoot. I think I feel like I told you guys that. Yes, we are going to the Disney store. We also want to try out like a restaurant while we're there. Um, um Harper has on the cutest outfit. Well, my mommy is out, Peaches. Her belly is out, peaches. <laughs> okay, so anyway, so um, <laughs> yeah. 
So uh, and then we want to come back. We want to show you guys this um, cool thing that we got for the girls uh, when we get back. And <laughs> I'm undone. That's um all we got. Oh, I want to show you guys. So yesterday, we, we had like a day yesterday. It ended up being a very good day. But um, Sequina had to get a lineup at... I'm looking at this owl. We ended up putting an owl. If you guys saw our last video where we had a fight with some birds. Anyway, so we had a fight with the birds. I think we won because they haven't been back. Um, this is like, this lighting is like really good. Hey, um, so Sequina had to get a lineup at nine in the morning. Harper had dance and I had a doctor's appointment for Holland at 11. Holland's appointment was really at 10. So I ended up being late and I like, I absolutely like love our pediatrician. I have a battery in my hand. I, a camera battery. I absolutely love our pediatrician, so I just hate being like late to things. Like being late to a party, but being late to like an appointment when you know it could potentially like back people up was so annoying. So I was so annoyed. Um, but they were able to fit me in, and it was just like I was just so 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 gracious. Um, so that's how the day started. So I get home. Um, Stephen came to be with the girls. Um, so that ended up being really good, and then he brought us a surprise. These are my favorite flowers, y'all. How pretty are they? And I don't know if you guys remember, but last year, um, when my grandfather passed, it was at the beginning of um, the panorama, and uh, Stephen had hydrangea. Do you say hydrangea? Y'all know what I'm talking about. Sent to the house, and it was so sweet because um, that was like my grandmother's favorite flower. So we actually ended up planting them, and Sequina thought I couldn't do it, but I did it, y'all. Look at them coming back. It's taken a solid year, <laughs> but I was patient, and I, um, you know, I prayed on them and everything. So yeah, so. Uh, if you remember, I, I can find that footage, but if you guys remember, uh, we were really excited about that. And so then for almost a year later, him to buy us some more and some pink ones. <sighs> so I will also be planting these. If you guys have any planting tips, let a girl know. Look how pretty they are. And then this is our, we showed you guys last time, this is a new patio set we got from um, Bad Bath & Beyond. I can have it linked in my Like to Know It. If you guys don't already, please follow the Like to Know It. I'm actually going to combine. I'm going to make my Like to Know It uh, me and Sequina's because she doesn't really post, but I know you guys want like links to her stuff, so I could just do it. Um, but I will have it updated on my Like to Know It. Last time I checked, the chairs were like pickup only, but it could be different in different states. So yeah. Y'all, Harper's crying. What's wrong? Sorry. Okay, come on. <laughs> we also got a new map too. It says, Welcome to our home. Uh, Look how cute you are. Oh, Peggy, it is. Dad, remember, Poppy, he just was been here. <coughs> my Poppy was been <coughs> My Poppy was <coughs> My Poppy was been here today because he left. Because his car is left. Okay. So, her Poppy was here yesterday in his car, and he left. Um, <clears throat> yes? I'm going to go in there. You want to go outside now? Yeah. Okay, you could go outside. Open the door. Because you don't want to walk outside without any shoes? Girl, we country. We can walk out without shoes. I mean, I have my shoes on. Well, you we that. Let me not make any facial expressions at anything that my child does because it can be interpreted any kind of way. Yeah, she can have a snack. All right, y'all. We'll see you guys in a few. Okay, y'all, so this is the little situation we have the girls in. Holland is doing so good. Harper, do you enjoy sitting in this? Yeah. You do? Yeah. And mommy? <laughs> All right, y'all, so we are going to, um, hmm? We're gonna record and um, take some content in the mall. And then I think we're gonna go to the Disney store and Shake Shack and then find some uh, uh, something else to snack on. And we'll take y'all with us. Okay, y'all, so I'm sitting in the back. Um, 
Woo! So we were supposed to go to Shake Shack when we were in the mall, you know, we were in like the wagon. So we couldn't find a way to get to Shake Shack from the outside where there was a ramp. All we saw were stairs to get to Shake Shack, Shake Shack at Perimeter Mall. Um, so then I suggested Jay Alexander just because every time we go, the food is always, always bomb. But the girls, oh, this is a cute little area. I feel like we went, did we go to something over here before? Um, Holland was acting upset because she wanted to eat. She wanted to eat, but she didn't want to hold her bottle. And then Harper, say, hey. she just wanted to like watch no her. You, who was crying? You said you were crying? She just really wanted to watch her. Um, we call it an iPad, but it's her, um, her prime. What is it? Her tablet, her Amazon tablet. Fire tablet okay um so how's the queen is feeling now she's just like she doesn't even trust them to um go into a restaurant and act right so she's just like we'll just have to like do a pickup somewhere so yeah 